Taking care of the surface of the B-52 is one thing, but when it comes to inspecting deep parts of the aircraft, there's a shop with all hands on deck. We're the doctors of the B-52. After every 450 flying hours, the B-52 goes out of service for major maintenance. Airmen at the Non-Destructive Inspection Lab, or NDI shop, look for cracks not visible to the human eye. They take a closer look at different pieces of the B-52 to ensure it's airworthy. We inspect the airplane uh, for cracks and major defects, uh, looking for anything that may uh, affect safety of flight. But how do they find cracks? They have three different methods. For example, they x-ray pieces of the aircraft using the same method and machinery a doctor uses when they x-ray our bones. Well, it's kind of like if you've ever gotten your piece of your body x-rayed at the doctor's and looked at that film. It's an essential, essentially the same thing. This unit even has a portable x-ray machine. Airmen take it out to the flight line and x-ray the B-52's wings. But parts of the B-52 cannot be x-rayed. This is why they have two other methods to inspect for cracks. This is where something called the mag particle unit comes in. We electrify a part to create a magnetism within and around the part to allow the, magneti the magnetizing to penetrate and our fluorescent oil to cover the part and show any cracks that might be available on that part. But how does it work? This oil has iron particles. That way, when they splash these pieces, it'll penetrate deep into the cracks. And when you shine it under the UV light, it'll expose the cracks. Then they have a different process where they dip parts of the B-52 into a different type of fluorescent goo-like substance. After we dip our part in the penetrant, it covers it completely, just like a green goo, super fluorescent. We bring it down here, we'll go to our spray line, we'll spray off about 80% of that penetrant we already dipped it in. The other 20% should be seeped into the crack, so we'll actually be able to see it once we go further down the line. And then our last one right here will be developer, which is a chalky white substance that actually covers the part and shows us the magnification of those green lines and cracks and defects that we might see in, the, in whatever part that we're actually testing. Out of these three methods, taking x-rays is preferred. Sometimes uh, with our other methods, we can only see surface, uh, surface defects and surface cracks, whereas this one we can see pretty much straight through that piece and anything in between. Although this shop is not in charge of fixing the cracks, these airmen are responsible for the flight crew members' lives. I'm very proud to wear this uniform. Um, I'm proud of what I do. Roxette Pietri Freeman, KTBS 3 News.